स्टूडेंट्स अ वेरी वॉम गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल ऑफ यू एंड वेलकम इन अवर बायोलॉजी सेशन सो वी आर डिस्कसिंग द पॉइंट दैट इज वॉट पार्ट ऑफ द स्केलेटन फ्रॉम द लेसन बॉडी मूवमेंट फ्रॉम द पार्ट ऑफ द स्केलेटन ऑलरेडी वी हैव डिस्कस अबाउट द स्कल बैकबोन एंड रिप केज सो टूडे वी विल मूव फॉर द नेक्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ द स्केलेटन दैट इज वॉट लिप्स सो स्केलेटन कंसिज द टू pairs of limbs there are the two pairs of limbs are present in the skeleton that are four limbs or also it is called as what arms and the next one is what hind limbs and also it is called as what legs okay so the four limbs means what arms and hind limbs means what legs so first we will discuss about the arms okay that is about what four limbs or arms so that four limbs or the arms connect to the backbone with the help of the shoulder girdle see here i i will show you the shoulder girdle see here this is called as what shoulder girdle okay so the arms or our four limbs are connected to the backbone with the help of this shoulder girdle and one more part helps to connect the arms to the backbone that is it is called as what collar bone okay so with the help of the collar bone and with the help of the shoulder girdle the arms are get connected to the backbone okay now the next one is that it consists the two parts the upper part of the arm having only one bone and the name of that bone is what humerus while the lower portion of the arms consists two bone it is formed with the help of the two bones that is what tibia and ulna this bigger one bone it is called as what tibia while this smaller one bone called as what ulna okay upper part is having only one bone and the name of that bone is what humerus while this lower portion of the arms are having two bones which are tibia and ulna next one in our wrist there are the eight bones and they are called as what carpels it is called as what carpels our wrist is made up of eight bones and that bones are called as carpels while our palm our palm is made up of five bones and they are called as what metacarpels they are called as meta carpel okay see here our palm is made up of what five bones and they are called as meta carpel and our finger consists or our finger is having each finger is having three bones in each finger there are three bones while in the thumb there are only two bones okay so in this way this is the whole four limbs both the four limbs are having the same structure and same number of the bones the four limbs or the arms are connected to the spine or the backbone with the help of the shoulder girdle and collar bone if the upper part of the arm is called as humerus the lower part consists the two bones that are tibia and ulna wrist are having eight bones which is which are called as carpels palms get made with the help of the five bones they are called as metacarpels each finger consists three bones while thumb consists thumb is made up of two bones okay so this is all about arms or four limbs now we'll discuss about the next pair of the limbs that is hind limbs or legs okay hind limbs or legs so the hind limbs or the legs are connected to the spine with the help of the pelvic girdle see here this is called as what pelvic girdle you can see this structure here this structure is called as what pelvic girdle so with the help of this pelvic girdle the legs are connected to the backbone next one the legs or the hind limbs also consists the two parts the upper part is having only one bone and the name of that bone is what femur the name of that bone is what femur okay and that femur is also called as what 
thigh bone and very important thing about the femur is that it is the longest bone present in the human body okay which is the longest bone present in the human body that is what femur next one the lower portion of the heel limbs again consists the two bones there are the two bones present in the lower portion of the limbs and the names of that bones are what here you can see the bigger one bone it is what tibia and the smaller one it is called as what fibula okay the larger one it is called as what tibia and the smaller one it is called as what fibula so in this way this is the structure of the hind limbs and the four limbs the four limbs are connected to the backbone with the help of the shoulder girdle while the hind limbs are connected to the backbone with the help of the pelvic girdle okay so in this way with the help of these different bones our whole body is get made now the last point we will discuss as the last part of the skeleton that is what girdles so just now we have seen that we have discussed so there are the two pair there, there are two girdles present in human body or there are the two girdles present in the skeleton first one is shoulder girdle and next one is what pelvic girdle shoulder girdle helps to connect the four limbs or arms to the spine or backbone while pelvic girdle helps to connect the or helps to join the hind limbs or legs to the backbone okay so in this way this is about what girdles and like that we have discussed all the parts of the skeleton we have seen about skull backbone or spine rib cage also we have discussed about the limbs and girdles okay so here we will stop we will meet in the next video with the next point and for today thank you